In this video, we're going to take a look at migrating our customized library files into Mastercam 2023. To start the process, I go to File, Convert, Migration Wizard. I'm going to choose Advanced, and I'm going to start by just migrating the post files first. This could all be done once. I'm going to break into two steps to just simplify it in case any errors pop up. Then I can go to File Types, and by clicking on File Types on top, it will unselect everything. And I'm just going to click the types that are my posts. So control definitions, machine definitions, post files. If you have uh, custom posts that have licensing on them, you'll also need to do the miscellaneous stat files. If you're not sure, you can always just check that. If you have mill turn add-on in Mastercam and you have dot machine environments, you can also check that. If you're not sure, you can also just check it. And then I can move to versions or hit the next button. And I'm just going to migrate files from 2022. So I'm going to have to leave just that checked. And then the migration will begin. Once the update process is complete, you can choose to view the results. I'm going to hit yes. And I'm just going to look that there aren't any errors. I don't have any. I, I do want to point out here that it only updates files that have been customized. So it's normal that it's skipped several uncustomized files of the same timestamp as the install. Now I can go to my machine tab and go to mill manage list and I can add my updated posts to my list. Now I'm going to run the migration again. File, convert, migration wizard. Advanced. This time I'm going to check both the shared and my. Notice I didn't point it out last time, but the uh, shared folder is a share on the network. We do recommend, even if the previous version was on the network, we might recommend migrating to the local drive first. And once you test and prove everything out is working, follow our sharing files on the network guide to place on the network and, and aim the various users at that again. So even if you're on the network, we recommend updating local. Like, like I am here, and then continuing on with our sharing process. So now I'm going to look at some other file types. Go to File Types and click on File Types to unselect everything. And uh, there are various file types here. Uh, s some you'll use, some you won't use. If you click on the file type, you get a description down there. Our uh, migration guide also gives some descriptions on some of the various files. I'm going to go ahead and check some of the more commonly used ones. I'm going to do default files. That's like your toolpath defaults. Tool libraries. That's your tools. Uh, machine simulation. If you have a machine simulation added to a post, you're going to want to migrate that. If you have any custom setup sheets, you're going to want to migrate those. Uh, your config files, like your master cam settings, file configuration, and your uh, Workspace files is if you've customized your interface any. So those are more, there's other files too, you may need more. Those are some of the more common ones. I can choose to hit next. I'm just going to migrate the 2022 files again. Now I can hit finish. And the migration starts. I have received a uh, message during this migration that there's a file that was updated in 2022 and already exists in 2023. Um, you have a few choices. To how do you want to do this? This has to do with the tool library. And I want to bring my tool library stuff from 22 into 23. So I'm going to say apply this action to all conflicts. And I'm going to say replace the original file. So it's going to update and replace the original one. If you're unsure about it, you could update and replace, but also back up the original file. But for I'm pretty sure that I wanted my 22 libraries in. So this will leave a cleaner installation. I don't have extra backups. Once again, I'm going to choose to view my report. And I don't see any errors. So now my Mastercam 2023 should be ready to use. As always, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact.